A lot of people hoping to hike, walk the dog, or go for a bike ride in Knox Mountain Park are going to have to wait. The park will remain closed for another day or two as the Kelowna Fire Department and BC Wildfire Service work to put out a fast-moving fire that popped up Saturday afternoon. Well, we're, we know for sure the park's going to be closed till at least Tuesday until we deem it safe. There are some sinkholes and some, some slope issues there um, that we're, we're dealing with right now. So until, until it's safe for the public to be in here, unfortunately, we're going to have to keep the park closed. Uh, but we are making a lot of headway. We're very happy with the progress and, and the work that all crews did. The wind was a definite challenge for firefighters. You should have seen it up top. Yeah, it was really windy. Uh, Kamloops Fire Center had reported that we were going to experience probably 35 kilometer winds right till midnight last night. And I can tell you from standing up there till midnight, that's exactly what it was. It was uh, a real challenge and uh, crews had to think really fast and moving apparatus and gear guys to get in front of it. And it was it was a fantastic job done by everybody. Kelowna's mayor was impressed with the quick response by firefighters and other first responders. There was potentially 1,400 properties that were at risk, homes for individuals that were at risk, who were expecting to enjoy Canada Day with a barbecue or other things, um, and that uh, you know became very concerning for them on, on where it was going. But uh, again, it was just I, I'm sincerely thankful on behalf of you know all of our citizens that they were able to uh, work with that fire as quickly as they were able to. Crews are hoping the weather cooperates and they can get the last of the hot spots out soon. In Kelowna, Cindy White, Castanet.